once you hit black diamond, you automatic win a brand new SL550, okay, or S550 Mercedes. How many people want to get the black diamond? And then they do your own personalized black diamond documentary. Guess what? You see these two guys back here? They work for Mona V. They doing my documentary right now. Y'all want this tasting party, right? Once I got into the network marketing arena, um, it just totally changed the way I live, the way I perceive things like now. Every day to me feels like um, the weekend. Me and my son are extremely close. I experience stuff many people haven't experienced in a lifetime. I'm just so blessed. We love automobiles. Lamborghini, Gallardo. Now we're going to look at our dream cars probably twice a week. He is really happy because of Mona Reed. I've always had that childlike passion for automobiles. And now to be able to be actually living my dream uh, because of this industry, because of this company, it's just life changing. I grew up in uh, Southwest Atlanta. We grew up on the kind of the fast side of town, but our moms and grandma pretty much still is in the right directions. I call it uh, upper low class, okay. <laughs> They was uh, kidnapping boys around our age, and uh, a couple of our friends actually got missing. That's my house that I was raised up in on the corner. We had a lot of drive-bys as well. Somebody was kind of shooting at another guy or something, and I was just walking up here. And it didn't really hurt me that bad because I was a long way, but I got hit in the back <laughs> from a gun. We were just kind of doing a documentary. Uh, because I became a multi-millionaire. When I came up and saw y'all, I said, this is exactly how we came up, shooting ball like this every day. Um, I had a very, very happy upbringing. Uh, very, very happy because as a child, you don't have to worry about paying bills and all that kind of stuff, so you don't know the struggles that your parents have. Eagle Land is a very, very prominent um, community, gated community in South Atlanta. Very affluent areas, a place that I've always dreamt of living. I used to come down here and couldn't even get in the gate. Very, very well-known entertainers. You got um, a lot of NBA players, baseball players. And this has always been a dream to me, of mine, to be able to come down and be able to not only buy a nice home in here, but to also have all of my uh, immunities to go with the swimming pool, to be able to live on the 11 green golf course, to be able to um, have all my cars. And his focus is, is to help his teammates, to help his families, to help their families to be successful and live the lifestyle that they all wanted to when they were kids and had dreams. He's my older brother. We're like a year apart. My family and I, we are very, very close. This is actually the core behind Robert Dean. He's always there whenever we need something. Every time you turn around, he had on a tie and a briefcase, and he's always said he would be rich. He always been smart. <laughs> my mom was just diagnosed with cancer. We have a family meeting, and I took my sister that's the most nurturing, and I said, look, I want you to take six months leave of absent. I'm going to pay you what you make on your job to be with my mom 24 hours so we can still do what we got to do. And that right there, you can't even put a price tag on it. He pay all our bills. Uh, just, just take care of us like he dependent man. And that's one of the things that I love about this industry is that you can truly help people and help yourself and your family at the same time. It took me realistically about 10 years to accomplish all of my goals and dreams that I wanted as far as homes, cars, all that kind of stuff. Um, and now I'm on my mission now to um, help 500 people become multi-millionaires over the next 10 to 15 years. 500 millionaires. That's always been his goal. <laughs> I put together a, a solid team of people. That's kind of my support base, uh, my extended family in this business. Well, this is my elementary school that I graduated from. Named back then, John Kerry Elementary. Even though people see the success that I've acquired in Mono V and in the network marketing industry, but I want people to know also, too, I do come from humble beginnings in 
this is the very reason why um, I go to different schools and do Millionaire Day and mentorship programs and also the re reason why I'm so fond of the more project that we have with our company Monavi. Giving kids uh, hope and, and also letting them know that you are ultimately responsible for your life. I ran to some old uh, people that I knew from a while back that never really uh, believe in the network marketing industry and they hadn't seen me in years and so when the guy came to the restaurant he asked me what I was doing and I told him I'm with Mona V and he said oh Robert I can't believe you still mess with them little network marketing business you in some juice business now and I said yes he said well you need to be in a you know a real industry like I'm involved with making a big big money and you know he went into all this stuff trying to make me feel bad about my industry and then so when we was outside walking towards our cars he didn't know what kind of car I was driving and so he was like, you see that Rolls Royce right there? Now, the people that drive that car, those are big business people. That's the kind of level I'm talking about. And I had my key in my hand, click, click. I said, you talking my car? And he almost died. <laughs> he was like, you got this in a healthy beverage industry? Yes. I said, um, you know, but I said, I know this quite not my, you know, quite the level that you're looking at. He said, oh, no, I'm not nowhere near that level yet. I didn't know. Maybe I need to look at what you're doing. Mona <laughs> We are changing people's lives, even if it's just three to four or five hundred dollars a week. To some people, that's more than what they make on their job. And to me, that is just mind-boggling. Thank you, Monica. <laughs> Thank you.